Prosecutors move closer to wrapping up their case in the Chandler Halderson trial. But not before trying to further establish the motive in the case. Eric Franke has the latest details from day eight of the trial. Eric? Well, Susan and Mark, prosecutors laid out the details of this elaborate ruse that Chandler Halderson allegedly used to get his parents to think he was attending Madison College and also trying to land a job. Now, this included fake email accounts that Chandler allegedly made up to communicate with his parents about his college students and other emails he used from people who didn't exist to deceive his parents into thinking he was working or trying out, trying to get jobs at high-profile local employers. Detectives closely examined the electronic trail left behind. What types of messages were you looking for uh, when looking at Chandler Halverson at gmail.com? What were you trying to figure out? Um, any communication um, with anyone from Madison College, um, anything related to his employment, either at SpaceX or American Family, um, any communications um, with his parents. If you could, at your and none of those people existed, and eventually Bart Halderson called Madison College suspicious, called them directly, frustrated in his attempts to get transcripts and certificates he believed Chandler had completed. Madison College official said he basically had withdrawn from classes, had failed others. There was also testimony a lot lot of it about cell phone use where it appears Chandler may have texted from his mother's phone to make it appear that she was texting him from a cabin at White Lake to say they had made it there safely when in fact that text came from the Halderson home. Now we thought maybe the prosecution would rest its case today but they've just wrapped up for the day they will continue tomorrow. Mark Susan. Eric thank you.